Hey guys, today I'm going to be doing a DIY video, and yes, I'm in my bathroom right now, and I'm filming in the mirror. Oh yeah, and I have no makeup on, but I don't think you can really tell. Um, I'm going to be doing a DIY video, and this is going to be a homemade spot treatment, and I really like this spot treatment. I think it's like the best spot treatment you can ever use. So yeah, we're just going to get started. I actually already started, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I can make a video about this, so that's why I'm doing it. So the first thing you need is baking soda, actually. It's the only thing you need. This is Arm & Hammer baking soda. And I'm using an old powder container, New York Color Smooth Skin, because I go through like 10 million of these. So I've already put baking soda in it this much. Yeah, about that much. And now I'm going to put some water in it. Not sure how much yet. This is just kind of like a guess and check thing. Just put some water in it. So I put about that much. Now I'm going to take a little toothpick. Just mix it together. And I put a little bit too much water in. So I need a little more. Because it's a little watery right now. It's going to, should be a... creamy formula so I put a little bit more in I don't know if you guys can tell so now I'm just going to mix that in and you want it to be like a creamy paste it's not it shouldn't be too watery and I still need more so you need a lot You want it to be very creamy. You don't want it to run at all. It just should be very creamy in consistency. There we go. It should be very creamy. So this is the finished product very creamy it doesn't run or too much yeah. so I actually came up with this idea like um, well over a year ago because whenever I would get a bee sting my mom would put baking soda on it and what it does is it sucks out the sort of venom that the bee keeps in you or whatever you get the point um, and so when you put it on your zits, it sucks anything out that is creating that zit. So it makes a amazing spot treatment. You do not want to put this all over your face though, because it's very, very drying. Just want to put it on like spots, like literally spots. And yeah, so I'm running out of memory right now, so I hope you guys like it. And thumbs up if you want more of these videos.